you're joining me here at Patchwork 2011 Spring, and I'm here with Kelso of Kelso Doesn't Dance, which makes me kind of sad because you know I love the dancing. Anyway, Kelso has some really cute, amazing stuff, so she's going to tell us about what she does. Tell me a little bit about what Kelso Doesn't Dance is. Well, I like to make all repurposed goods. Um, I make notebooks here. They're all funny things I find at reuse centers and thrift stores, mixed pages inside, um, graphed papers, and notebooks people aren't using any longer, wallets from atlases and dictionaries. Um, I make all kinds of things out of dress shirts and just all repurposed accessories. I kind of get excited about one thing and that leads to another thing. Something I really like is that you know we see a lot of these spiral notebooks but usually it's someone has taken a blank spiral cut up the pages yeah. and put it in and when I was looking through you have like there's pieces of golden books and some of them pieces mm -hmm. of maps and yeah. I I just liked it because a lot of times journals are for are for, are for <laughs> creativity right. and and having a page that's unexpected, I think, just kind of perpetuates that and spurs it on. And I was like, oh, yeah. that'd be fun. It's sort of a surprise. <laughs> like, what's each page exactly. going to be? Exactly. Yeah, it's really fun making them, looking through, um, seeing what ends up on what page. Here's a, a math problem on this page. Sometimes there's children's writing in them, which is really fun. Really um, sweet. Yeah, like a huge number nine or, you know, here's half a cow. And, you know, just it's really fun making them. So. And you use one of my favorite items from childhood, which is little golden books. Yes. And so many times the, the golden spine is eaten because apparently it's delicious if you're under seven. And so I was really happy to see that you find a way to take the golden book spine off and yes. repurpose it. So can you show us some of those? Just yeah, bring over. definitely. Here's, uh, it's the original books here, original covers. And then I keep the pages in throughout. And then I also add lined paper, which is 100% recycled. And then most of the stories in the back. So if this was your favorite story as a child, you can still read it and check it out, or just the illustrations are great. Totally. What you said, so. Absolutely. Well, and Mary Blair did some of them, and <laughs> yes. if you know Mary Blair from Mary Blair from Disneyland, thank you. <laughs> so I can fly. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh, you see, kindred spirit. <laughs> All right. Well, Kelso, that's awesome. I think your stuff yeah. is really inspiring. Thank, thank you. you.